What's going on guys? It's your boy Apathy back with another video. Now before we start the video, I want to say two things. One, I know I haven't done a vlog in a while, but I decided to do one today. You know, I've been posting tip videos almost every single day, helping you guys out, and I really appreciate the feedback, the support, and I hope you guys have been enjoying them. And two, look at this shirt. This is the best shirt ever. ever. Winners are chosen, not, I mean, winners are made, not chosen. Remember that. Work hard for what you want. Grind play games do whatever you want man just, just fucking work hard so I get this question asked a lot and people are wondering Apathy what are you doing what what is your team like what's happening are you still on E6 what's going on and you know today's video I decided to explain a lot about talk a lot about it and explain but I can't tell you everything obviously yet because it's nothing has been announced so I'm gonna talk a little bit about it and kind of go just in depth pretty much what happened. So I've been released from E6. A lot of you guys saw tweets about a week ago that I was joining C9 with Silly and Silly and Mochilla. That didn't really happen because I got another offer. And this offer, in my opinion, was a it was better for me in the long run. It was just a better offer in general. So I decided to take it. Now I'm currently no longer in E6 right now. Uh, Study, I believe, is no longer in E6 either because he's been playing with me. So right now that leaves E6 with Dido and Sensor. There's a couple players out there for free that are free agents, so they might pick them up and they might form E6. I don't know what's gonna happen with that team, but that's kind of their situation. Now you know I love Doug. I've been talking to Doug on and off about the whole situation when it was happening. I really wanted him to join the team. The problem with Doug, and I explained this in my stream a while ago, is that he has a really problem with Brandy because he wants to stay with the Face brand. You know that's like his life. That's him. He wants to be Face Sensor. And you can't have face sensor. You can't have face if you join another team, right? The other team wants you to brand dumb, wants you to rock their sponsor, wants you to change your ad. You know, pretty much the money they're investing in is is you know you're giving it back by by promoting them and their sponsors and all that stuff. So due to that, a lot of teams didn't want to pick them up, and especially the team that the org that we joined and the org that we're joining and the team I have right now, they didn't want to pick them up. But I really wanted a team with Doug. I think Doug was is a great player. And when we were on the team, he was definitely one of the best right next to me. So I really wanted to play with him. But unfortunately, due to his circumstances, you know, he understood. And I told him, man, like, I, I really want a team with you. I said, I told him, like, straight up, you know, you're, you're, you've been playing really good. But with the whole thing, you know, I recommend if, we, if you could join, join. If you can't, dude, just stay with E6 or do whatever you, you're doing right now. And just keep doing your YouTube thing. You know, you're doing great. You know, me, me and Doug are pretty good friends. And... You know, good luck to good luck to E6, good luck to Dido and Center. So right now it's me, Study, Merc, and Burns. Uh, we've been scrimming lately. I don't know if you guys have been watching. We've been doing pretty good. First like day or two was a little rocky, but we started to pick up. We're starting to play really good. Uh, you know, it's it's not nothing's official official yet, but this is pretty much gonna be the team. Um, the org hasn't been announced yet, and probably won't be announced for a couple more days. So. I really don't want to get too into that right now, but that's pretty much the players I've been playing with. I've been playing with Study, Merc, and Burns. I've obviously teamed, I was teaming with Mercs at the beginning of the game. We decided to, you know, kind of leave him, join Dito's team, and replace him with Dito. Uh, Study, I teamed with him for like two weeks before the qualifier. He was playing really good, unfortunately, during qualifier. The last match of the qualifier, he didn't play too good. But, you know, it happens. And Burns, I teamed with him last year. I love his attitude and everything. So, we, like I said, we've been scrimming. Uh, we've been playing pretty damn good. You know, we fit each other pretty well. Merc and Study are like our ARs. Me and Burns are like the subs. I can, I'm like a hybrid. I can run a 30 R. So all, all, like overall, we fit the roles pretty good. You know, we all want this. We all want to win, etc., etc., etc. And this is the team we're going to be using to requalify. And I know I'm still a sub for Elevate for people who are asking me, like, are you still a sub for Elevate? What's happening? You know, what's your current team situation? I'm still a sub for Elevate. Elevate. This whole teamy thing does not do anything to my CWL like sub like a lot of you guys gotta understand that like if let's say if I join unless I join an actual lead team or I, I become a starter then I will no longer be a sub for Elevate but as long as the team's not in CWL as long as I'm not at the league like I will still be a sub for Elevate I believe I'm playing a match today or it's tomorrow I believe it's today I'm playing in a match or it might be tomorrow I'm gonna be playing the first two matches so that should be fun and then on top of that, what was I going to say? And then on top of that, I'll make a new video whenever the announcement, whenever the org is announced and everything, explaining the whole thing. But a lot of you guys really know that I've been playing with Study, Merc, Merc and Burns. It's nothing, you know, hidden. But I, I will make another vlog or another video explaining the whole team, you know, maybe going more in depth and the org we joined and everything. So either way, guys, before I go, I want to say one more thing because I love talking. I love talking to you guys. 
I've been streaming on Twitch lately. Now, I am not partnered on Twitch yet, and I'm still working my contract with MLG, but I, I just couldn't take MLG anymore, and me not even being a big streamer, like, if I was a big streamer on MLG, obviously going to Twitch would be better, but if I was a big streamer on MLG, I would be making pretty damn good money because I'd be getting a lot of viewers, a lot of subs, whatever it is. But since I'm not a big streamer, you know, I don't get many views, I don't even make that much money. I was like, and I, I tried so many times, I've been talking to them so many times, and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna start streaming on Twitch. And I'm not even a partner at Twitch, I don't even make ad revenue, I don't make subscriber button revenue, I don't make anything. The only thing I make off is donations. But lately, like, you guys have been truly supportive, you guys have been donating, so it's it's been kind of the worthwhile, it's been pretty good, like, the the income has been pretty even, so I was like, fuck it, dude, I love Twitch, I love, I love everybody on Twitch, everyone's so good vibes, everyone's just chatting. So I decided to keep streaming there, and I will be streaming there uh, forever, hopefully. Uh, check out my channel. I'm really trying to get partnered right now. It's probably going to take at least a couple more days. But make sure to check out my channel. You know, visit if you're watching this video. Come come by. It's uh, twitch.tv slash apathybz. I'll leave a link down in the description below as well. And I just hope you guys have a good day, man. Just smile. This has been your boy Apathy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'm out. Peace!